Jason, we've looked at uh, a lot of different parts of a computer, but we haven't yeah. really talked about a printer. And a printer is oh. a very important part of it. Yeah. In fact, the computer goes so fast that sort of the typewriters won't work anymore. Remember how a typewriter worked? Yeah. Push, push, push a key for a letter. And then up came a, a, you know, a hammer and yeah. found it on the paper, and then it came back again. You had to push another one. Well, today, they've got better typewriters than that. They have a ball, for yeah. example, that spins around. But today, there are sort of, well, two basic types of uh, computer printers. One of them uses a variation of a, called a daisy wheel. Oh, and here yeah. you can see why it's called a daisy wheel. Doesn't that look like a little daisy? Yeah. Okay. And around the outside are little fingers, little petals of the daisy. And on the end of each one of those is a letter. Oh. So that this can spin back and forth very quickly. And then when it gets in the right position, a hammer comes from behind and pokes it. And so that would hit the paper and that, make the letter. Right. So now you have much less moving parts and it can go at fairly high speed. So that's mm -hmm. one kind that makes sort of what they call letter quality, using mm -hmm. a daisy wheel yeah. of some kind. Then the other one is called dot matrix. And oh. here I have a matrix. There's five spaces in this direction, and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven in that direction. Yeah. And I have formed the letter A with these yeah. little red balls. Now, the little red balls stand for wires. So when the computer sends a signal, it says, push this wire, that wire, this wire, this wire, this wire, this wire, this wire, to print the yeah. letter A. Okay, now we want the letter B, so you rearrange the little wires. Well. Here are more wires over here if you need them. Okay. There. Okay, now you'd poke that series of wires. And this means that the computer can go very, very quickly because it sends a signal up to the print head yeah. to print each one of those wires in whatever form that, that it's called for for the character. Now, in fact, I've got it all set up. Come on over here and take a look okay. at this. You hold that switch down right there. All right. And I can turn on the printer, and it's now going to print every one of the wire combinations that's in the printer. Okay, I'm holding you, it down. Okay, now let go. Here they come. Wow. Some of them aren't letters. No, they have all kinds of graphic symbols, too. Yeah. Notice it's printing in both directions, too. Yeah. Backwards and forwards. Backwards and forwards. So that's how you gain uh, a lot more speed by using printers that are designed specifically to work with computers.